The first thing on our list is the sclera. The sclera is the white of the eye. It is this connective tissue layer um, that gives the eyeball its shape. The white of the eye is the sclera. Next thing on the list is the conjunctiva. The conjunctiva is actually um, a membrane that extends from the white of the eye to our eyelids, and it's not represented on this model. On this model, though, is the cornea. The cornea is this very clear layer through which light passes. This is the cornea. I'm going to show you the cornea here. This clear layer is the cornea of the eye. Now I'm going to open the eye so that uh, you can see the cornea. This clear layer right here is the cornea of the eye. Um, <clears throat> uh, if I take the eyeball apart, we'll be able to find the other structures in the eye. The choroid is this layer at the back of the eyeball where we find the blood vessels. A bunch of blood vessels form the layer that we call the choroid. The choroid thickens into what we call the uh, ciliary body right here. The ciliary body is a bunch of little muscles that adjust the shape of the lens. Here is the lens. I'm holding in my fingers the lens. The, um, uh, if we drop down to the next layer on the inside of the eyeball, we find the iris. So here is the iris, here's the ciliary body, here's the choroid coat. Now if I go to the outside of the eye, we can see the iris a little better. The iris is what dilates or constricts our pupil. The pupil is the hole here. Put the eye back together. The pupil will be the hole right here. It's covered by the cornea, but here I can put the probe right through the pupil because all it is is a hole. In the uh, <clears throat> back of the eyeball, posterior eyeball, we find our um, layer that has the, um, ro the rods and the cones in it, and that is the retina, but it doesn't have a good representation in this model for the retina. We'll find that in the cow eye. This represents the vitreous body, which is a gel-like uh, very vitreous, very gel-like little uh, structure. It's uh, not runny, but gel-like that fits in the eyeball and gives the eyeball its nice round shape and holds the retina up against the back wall of the eyeball. And between the lens, between the lens and the cornea is the aqueous humor which is a liquidy, watery uh, substance that's found right in this region. That's everything for the model.